Yeah. Yeah, it does. And I, I'm sure Dan said it in here, but he's been preaching it to us all week. Like, we are the same team we have been. The same team we were in week one, beating Kansas City. The same team that, you know, has, has had, you know, great games on the road. Or, you know, we're the same team. Nothing's changed. And um, every team goes through ups and downs and lulls. And, and we hit a little bit of a stumble there for maybe call it two or three weeks of, of certainly our offensive play. And um, But we're the same team. We're the same guys, the same people, the same players. Um, and just kept reminding us that. Yeah, it felt good. It felt really good. I thought we had a great plan. I thought uh, Ben was very uh, conceded effort to be uh, aggressive, and and that was um, seen early through his play calling. And we were we were trying to be aggressive, and um, I loved it. I thought it was awesome, and uh, I, I think you know towards the you know, middle of the game, end of the game there. He felt like he could call anything, and, and we were going to make it work. We were we were moving guys up front. We were making good plays in the past game, and um, yeah, it was a good uh, all-around effort. Can you talk about your comfort level with the same Yeah. Set a rookie record. Yeah. 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 I mean, both those guys. I was thinking about it like halfway through how those two guys were such an impact. As rookies, they're they're two of the best rookies I've ever been around, and like for for what they handle mentally and what they do every Sunday for us, and um, the way they practice, the way they're pros, everything they're as good as it gets. And um, you see the results out here on the game day, but the work they put in, and um, again how professional they both are, and it's uh, it's really impressive. It really is. And um, obviously Sam's numbers have been uh, pretty big this year, and uh, he deserves it. He's playing he's playing really well. Yeah. Yeah, it's been all year. You know, you've been you, you've been kind of, you know, hoping for that all year that you can get one in front of the home fans and um, still have games to win for us. But yeah, it, it would be it'd be a lot of fun, and uh, they've been bringing it every home game. And um, yeah, it would be fun. But we got some work to do. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think every team goes through that, but our superpower is how we respond. And it's, it starts with Dan, and it then goes to me, and through the offense, and the coordinators, and the coaches, everybody. Um, our superpower is how we, res we respond as a team, as a unit, um, as a group. We've been through uh, a lot of adversity as a group, and a three-game lull where we've you know, one, one of three. Um, it's not the worst thing we've been through. So, being able to bounce back is something that we've prided ourselves on, and um, tonight was a big one to bounce back with. Yeah, they they played so well. They they played so well. They did their thing tonight. They put it on their back in a lot of ways, and um, I was sitting back there, pretty pretty comfortable for most of the night. And um, yeah, they played really well. Yeah. It's always the same thing, you know. I, you're you're aware that that's what they do, and um, you're aware of. Uh, I think their big stat was how many forced fumbles that they have. So you're aware of it, and you're holding the ball a little tighter in traffic. But but you're playing free. You're playing loose. You're letting it rip. Um, you're not afraid. Uh, it's a good defense we just played, and we played really well against a really good defense against a really good team. Um, and yeah, it's it's a it's a credit to the work we put in. What's it like to do five straight touchdowns? Hmm. Feels great. Feels, yeah. Yeah. No, it feels it feels great. Uh, it's it, it's like kind of like a flow state, right? Like you get into a rhythm, and um, like I mentioned, sometime in the middle of that second quarter, throughout the rest of the game, it felt like Ben could have called anything, call, call whatever you want, and he felt that way. Um, and and it was just up and down the field, and we were running the ball well, we were throwing the ball well. I think we had the one three and out in the fourth quarter, but other than that, um, had a really really good game. So what? Yeah. 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 He's he's coming on. He really is. And um, again, it's 
it's the work and practice. It's 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 all the extra hours and, and everything he's doing to, to deserve it. But I, I trust him. He's he's where he needs to be. He's catching the ball in, in tough locations, and um, I think it's only going to keep going up uh, for him. The, the sky's the limit. Um, he's a hell of a player. He's a hell of a kid, and he's working hard right now. Just back to the last two, it looked like tonight you used more of them to high volume as you have all year. Was that just as yeah. Yeah, I, I think it was kind of like he felt like he could call anything, and he, he kind of did all night. You know, we didn't really go backwards after those first couple drives, um, moving the ball and play action, drop back, run the running game. Um, it was all there, and it all starts with the O line. Uh, you know, like I was saying earlier, they were playing as well as they were. It, it opens up a whole lot for us, and um, yeah, that's how the ball ends up going to however many people were targeted. Is just kind of everything's clicking. I'm sorry, I feel on that too. Big boys just said to uh, Ben feeling like you can call anything. You felt that Ben. Do you have that conversation? And what is that like? Yeah. Call that up, whatever. You know, work. Yeah. Uh, there's not much of a conversation. It's just he says. I can call anything right now, and it's going and it's going to work, <laughs> and uh, that gives us confidence. Um, but he's he's saying it because uh, of what we're doing on the field and the way we're executing and the way the O line's playing, and, and that's just how he feels. And when you get a play caller to say that, it, it feels pretty good. He just tells all of us all the time. Yeah, if he feels that way. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think it meant more to him just for our team to get number ten. Certainly, but I know there's you know part of him that's it's special. That was this guy for so long, a mentor to him, I'm sure, in some ways. And um, yeah, anytime you can get one against the, the guy who kind of taught you a lot, it's it's special.